Welcome back to another video. Today, we're changing the PCV valve in my F-150. This is my 2016 F-150 with the 2.7 EcoBoost in it. And I uh, had the check engine light come on. And after reading the code, it was saying that the PCV valve slash pressure relief, crankcase pressure relief uh, valve is giving us a problem. And so first thing we're gonna try is just to change the PCV valve. Uh, Ford, I think, says that you're supposed to change them out every 60,000 miles anyway. Um, I now have, I bought my truck with 60,000 miles on it and now has 135,000. So it's time to change it anyway. Now to do this, it's super simple. You just need two things. You need a 10 millimeter wrench and a, uh, a pair of pliers. That's it, nothing else. Okay, so this is so easy that we're gonna do this in real time. So you need 10 millimeter, you're gonna take off uh, this little nut here. And there's one back here behind the oil filler cap. Rest by hand. Where's that? Take the oil filter cap off, or oil oil fill cap. Sorry, my bad. And this will lift out of the way. Put your oil cap back on. And the PCV valve is right here. It's uh, brown. You can see it uh, there. Um, now, if this doesn't work, you may also have to change out your um, uh, the other uh, uh, crankcase pressure sensor. Uh, and that is this piece here. So it comes off the same way as this one does. There's a little cam lock on the side here. We're gonna push it in. Try to turn it. There you go, pop right off. Now we're gonna take our pliers. Give it a little twist, and it pops right off. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty cruddy. All right, let me grab the other one, which is inside the truck. Uh, I got the genuine Ford part. Went down to the dealership. It was less than ten dollars, so don't try to order something off of uh, Amazon. This is just easier. You'll feel it click in there, and you know it works. That is done. Oil cap off. goes on, oil cap goes on, and then the nuts go back on. Hardest part right there is having fat fingers.
Done. Okay, let's see if uh, this fixes it. We'll start her up. And yep, check engine light's gone. So if your check engine light doesn't go off with just doing the PCV valve, you will have to do that other, the crankcase pressure sensor, uh, which is that whole hose piece that they give you. Um, again, you're gonna have to take off that cover to get to the one side of it, uh, but the other side is outside of that cover area. Um, you'll just have to unplug it and then they, the cams come off the same way as you did with the PCV valve. So that's it. Um, really, just go to the Ford dealer and get the uh, PCV valve. Uh, mine had them in stock and it was less than $10. Uh, I looked at Amazon and they were about the same cost, but uh, people complained that they didn't work. Uh, so it was more than one thing on there uh, for those. So uh, go to your Ford dealer and spend $10 because that's what it's going to cost anyway. And uh, fix it in a couple minutes. So hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something. Take care.